As we continue to celebrate Women's History Month, we are highlighting several Central Florida women who are making a difference. Seminole County Fire Assistant Chief has been with the department for 30 years, and she's getting ready to retire next month. Yeah, but she is not saying goodbye just yet. She wants to make sure her crews get a home-cooked meal. News 6's Ezzy Castro has her story. It, to me, that's the best part of the fire service, is to be able to sit around the table, laugh, joke around, learn about everybody's family and what they're up to. Seminole County Fire Assistant Chief Becky Ward doing one of the things she loves, cooking. On the menu, chicken biscuits with a hint of goat cheese before the crew from Fire Station 12 goes out the door to begin their shift. Cooking has always been a part of our family. And so my love of food and cooking, I just brought that with me when I when I came to the fire service. It was in 1993 that Ward joined the department. She was inspired by her father, who served in the Geneva Fire Department. Were there any females at that time that you saw? There were females in um, the Seminole County Fire Department. We, we had one female lieutenant at the time when I was hired. Over the years, Ward climbed the ladder, becoming a lieutenant, a battalion chief, and in 2020, was promoted to assistant fire chief. Fire chief asked me uh, to uh, cover fire support and um, I kind of went kicking and screaming. And then once I got into it, it was, it's been very rewarding. Right now, there are only 23 female firefighters with Seminole County, including four female lieutenants. You have to have a service heart to want to do this job because it's not for everyone. So if somebody, male or female, wanted to do this job. They really have to have the heart for it and the desire to do it and then make it happen. But there's another job, the most important one, being a mother. With two daughters and two stepkids at home, Ward says these guys are like sons to her too. And she will miss them when she officially retires in April, but not without one last delicious meal. It's bittersweet. Um, I'm ready to retire. 30 years is a long time. Um, but that was the whole purpose of the farewell tour, to be able to go spend one last, one last meal, one last time joking around, getting some pictures, um, and spending that time with the people that had a significant impact in my career. In Seminole County, Ezzy Castro, you know, results, New 6. Retirement looks so different now than oh, when I was goodness. a kid. Yes, <laughs> I mean, sure. she's ready to have her second act in life yes. and enjoying everything. Can we talk about those chicken biscuits and a hint yes. of goat cheese? Uh, we need to know more about that. <laughs> we Maybe. need the, mm -hmm. the more is we need the recipe. Right, we need her to tweet that. Yeah, exactly. Right oh, now. it sounds so good. Yes, absolutely. Yeah.